passage, we are in Acts chapter 7, uh, verses 1 through 10, uh, page 1061 in your pew Bibles, or 1701 in the large print edition. Acts chapter 7, beginning in verse 1. Now, we've been uh, talk, reading through Acts, and uh, last week we re will recall that Stephen was brought before the Sanhedrin to explain uh, what he was up to, what the Holy Spirit was doing through him. And uh, he begins a very long speech, which is going to take us a couple of weeks to get through. But it's a snapshot of what God had been doing through his people. So beginning Acts chapter 7, verse 1. Let's read out loud together. Then the high priest asked him, Are these charges true? To this he replied, Brothers and fathers, listen to me. The glory of God glory appeared to our father Abraham while he was still in Mesopotamia before he lived in Haran. Leave your country and your people, God said, and go to the land I will show you. So he left the land of the Chaldeans and settled in Haran. After the death of his father, God sent him to this land where you are now living. He gave him no inheritance here, not even a foot of ground. But God promised him that he and his descendants after him would possess the land, even though at that time Abraham had no child. God spoke to him in this way, Your descendants will be strangers in a country not their own, and they will be enslaved and mistreated for 400 years. But I will punish the nation they serve as slaves, God said, and afterward they will come out of that country and worship me in this place. Then he gave Abraham the covenant of circumcision, and Abraham became the father of Isaac and circumcised him eight days after his birth. Later, Isaac became the father of Jacob, and Jacob became the father of the twelve patriarchs. Because the patriarchs were jealous of Joseph, they sold him as a slave into Egypt. But God was with him and rescued him from all his troubles. He gave Joseph wisdom and enabled him to gain the goodwill of Pharaoh, king of Egypt, so that he made him ruler over Egypt and all his palace. Amen. And the story will continue for several weeks. I invite the kids to come forward. Uh, Bob